What is up guys, Matt from School Buses and today we're talking about Firestorm. So these are my little top tips, just simple top tips. Just follow these and it could guide you a, even a win because I, I do this and I got one win on a squad game because uh, I, I was playing as a duo and my mate had to leave halfway through. So if you can go check that out, it'll be in the link and iCard in the description. So go check that out. But other than that, my top tips are just pretty simple and easy to follow. Nothing too hard. And hopefully they can get an easier win for you guys. So yeah, if you're gonna dislike them, it's pretty simple. And um, yeah, enjoy the video. Right, for this tip, I'm going off landscape. So what you're gonna do, if you if you like the south of the map, you want to be the um, uh, the British basically, and have like a a green brown texture or camouflage. But if you like going to the north, which I prefer to, is have uh, and being the snow is have the dark grey and white camo. So that's my type of camo, or this one, and it's easier. <laughs> just to hide in the bushes or blending with the background. So that's why I was like, try and customize my company. I just don't leave it bare like this one. That, that is basically bare. I, I won't never choose that because I'll change the hat, get a bit of different coat on to match the landscape. See, I would choose like that type because the hat's not giving it away. And then you've got your bullets and your camo is blending in with the background in the bushes so that's that tip just an easy little tip just like that can help you blend in with the background so for my first tip so as you can see the plane is going south so what you're gonna do you want to head towards the outskirts of the ring so in this case you want to be coming like far up to these villages because no one will be coming up here so like this little house, no one would be coming in here because I would go there. I would go there because no one would go in there. Uh, I would be going here, over here. So just for like people who can't play the game properly, like me, I I'm not the best at this game, but this is what I do to survive. I go to that, that furthest way to go, uh, the furthest way. Yes, I'm about to end the map, but yeah, I go furthest away. So right now, I don't know what's happening, but I'll keep showing you. So I would like recommend go here or oh, these little houses. So this is what I would like do in my general game every single time because when we're on squads and doing duos, just me and my mate, that's what I'll be end up doing. So for like this, for this little instance, I think no one's going to be here. And look what I'm coming against. A bunker. There's a bunker right here and I didn't even notice. So this is just like a little... So this is like an example. No one is here. It's out of the block, out of the way. So I would recommend going to the little... The little places if you want to survive. That's how what I would recommend. That's how I do it. It's your choice, your personal preference. But if you're like new to the game and you want to... Get further into the firestorm, I would recommend this. Right, for my next tip, I would recommend you to get familiarised with the map, uh, how to use it, this particular map, not like where you're going, but what I normally do, uh, instead of like having a map like this and go, oh, I'm down here, I would like zoom in. I know it's like simple and stupid, but it's very helpful for me to familiarise. So I can see where the buildings are, I can see what terrain, where's the highest point to go if you want to might be king of the hill. So that's how I would uh, assume things. Right, for my next tip, obviously you can see I've not been that far. I've just been in this little building and a few of over these. So for my next tip, run with the firestorm. So wait for the countdown or wait for 20 seconds or 30 seconds because I've got a bit of a run to go give yourself a bit of time uh, otherwise don't rush yourself because if you want to survive this is how I do it I wait till like the very last couple of seconds 
of the firestorm to begin and I'll just run with the storm because the storm's slow enough you can run with the storm at times depending where you are on the map like if you was over here the storm will come in quick but if you was like over here the storm will come in like very slowly so at this distance with me I know I can walk it or even run it so I'm gonna leave it to like the very last seconds and then just run with the storm because if you want to survive you survive with the storm if you want to get fit in further into the uh, firestorm I won't recommend shooting people so I would recommend just hiding all the time if you want to get fired because that's what I do as you can see I just got shot up uh, that's not my go-to thing to do I t tend to wait so I'm gonna wait this out and since there's people over the hill and there's someone close to me so I'm gonna wait this out again one more time so that's what I'm gonna do so as you can see I'm just still waiting it out even though there's three people there if you want to survive this is how you're gonna do it it's just I'm not that good at rushing people yet plus I, I don't have the best of guns to rush anyone so that's what I'm not gonna do I'm gonna just wait it out oh so I'm just gonna just crawl over here